Hi, Mark here from MyWhistleAndFlute.com and I have some minor flutes to show you today. These are some of the newest flutes that we're offering both on our website and um, on our Etsy store which you can get to through our website MyWhistleAndFlute.com Minor. Minor key is awesome. I really really love it especially for improvising if you just want to go out and just have fun playing around. But you know, um, in addition to the minor key, we have made these three flutes in a pentatonic scale. Pentatonic meaning a five note scale. So I won't go into the theory of that. Some of you have more uh, background in that than I do. Some of you have less. We're just gonna get lost in the weeds. These are five, uh, five whole flutes. So not including the sound hole. So here is our uh, minor pentatonic flute in the key of E flat minor. So this is an E flat minor pentatonic flute. Now, one of the things that makes this so cool is some of you, when you were younger playing the piano, played that song on the black keys of the piano where you took the, the three, the, the, there are actually only five black keys in um, re repeating order on the on the keyboard, and it was that and you drove your parents crazy with that. That was the E minor pentatonic scale. And so all black keys. And so this flute is the same as all of as if you played only the black keys on the piano. And it actually sounds really great. The best thing about pentatonic scale is going just by going up and down the scale, it always sounds good. You literally can't play the wrong note and have it sound bad. You can make up your own music. So let me give you an idea of the scale. Again, just five notes. Now on this one, the finger stretch is a little bit much. So instead of using my ring finger, uh, like index middle ring, I use index middle pinky on my right hand. And then there are only two finger holes in the left hand. So index and middle. Let me give you an idea of how this sounds. So because this is a minor scale as well, it has a really just a cool sound, almost a, a if you will, a, an Asian sound. I don't know if you're supposed to say that or not, but um, and you can get kind of that kung fu sound uh, out of your flutes just by some simple dynamics. For example, when you're when you have all five holes covered, if you take your index finger of your right hand and just kind of flick it up and down, you can get kind of a cool sound. Let me show you what that sounds like. The same thing can happen if you are if you have these uh, top two, your left hand, index and middle down, and you uh, pop the index finger up and down. Also with that cool sound is a technique where when you go, when you end on the root note all with all five holes covered and you just give a little short burst of uh, uh, faster air at the end, you can get again that kung fu sound. So so I really do like that. So you can play around with that and have a lot of fun. But this would be good for medium to large hands. I have one here that is, and I can make this in other keys if you just let me know. But I think if you use, if you skip the ring finger and you use your pinky, um, even small hands, uh, with the exception of children, small adult hands uh, should be able to get these, get these notes. This plays in one and a half octaves plus with some alternate fingerings, you can get all the way up in the two octaves, but just a lot of fun to play around with. The next one, um, the next size up, it, and these next two are both end blown flutes. I've taken the Kenna uh, style notch here on the end and made this an end blown flute. There is no back hole like a traditional Kenna would, but it has the benefit of that relaxing. Playing these end blown flutes is incredibly relaxing. This also is five holes, three on the bottom, again, skipping the ring finger. Um, and using the, the pinky and then the two on the top. This is a little bit um, higher sounding. This is an F sharp minor um, pentatonic flute.
So F sharp minor. The next one, just exactly the same, but much smaller. Even uh, a child could hold this flute easily. Five holes again, a minor pentatonic scale. This is a, uh, let me get this right. Um, oh, I'm sorry, I told you wrong. This is our D minor flute. I told you F. This is D minor. This is our F sharp minor flute. So we have the um, E flat minor transverse flute or side blown flute. We have the D minor um, in the, pen, uh, in the uh, uh, end blown and then the F sharp minor. Um, so and you can find that more details about that on the website, but this is an F sharp minor It's much smaller, but it has a powerful sound lots of fun to play One of the songs to give you an idea that was written in a pentatonic scale is Wayfaring Stranger, kind of an old spiritual uh, song. And maybe you know it or maybe you don't, but let me just play it for you to give you an idea of how it sounds even on this beautiful uh, F sharp uh, minor scale. F sharp minor uh, pentatonic scale, our D minor pentatonic, both end blown flutes, and then our E flat minor side blown uh, pentatonic flute as well at mywhistleandflute.com.